I made discipline easy for anyone and I want to reveal to you the simple steps that I took, how truly anyone can achieve this no matter where you're standing in life and I'll show you the struggle I went through to make discipline something that truly comes naturally to me. I know since you're watching this video, you're aware that we are in a constant fight to keep our discipline. But what is discipline? Doing the things you know you should do even if you don't want to do them. You see the struggle which is making discipline so hard for all of us is that social media companies, the fast food industry and adult sites are investing billions to make you less disciplined. So how do you face a multi-billion dollar industry with discipline? I'll show you exactly that. But before we need to figure out what level of discipline you're at to make sure you're able to action everything I'm about to teach you. And a secret fourth level other self-improvement YouTubers don't want you to be at. Level 3. The extremist. Your every action is highly controlled and calculated. You decided a crystal clear goal for your life and every single thing you do is aimed at achieving that goal. You never give in to unhealthy or unproductive habits or for that matter anything that doesn't serve your goal. Level 2. The aware. You have a pretty clear idea of what you want and you make sure that you're on the right path to getting there. But you are far away from getting the most out of your time. You have your regular guilty pleasures of sleeping and not really watching what you eat and letting your lust and primitive desires decide what you do. And then there is level one the trapped. You are trapped and your addictions ruin your life. Big social media companies like Instagram and TikTok run your days and decide how you feel. You constantly crave fast food, you never exercise and you can't get yourself to stop watching adult online movies. If you see yourself at level 1 or 2, this video is for you. But unlike other self-improvement YouTubers, I don't want you to be a level 3 extremist. I want to get you to the sweet golden spot of around 2.5 by making discipline easy for you but still having a life. Everything more than a 2.5 and life tends to get quite sad and lonely. What you and I care about is not to crash our well-being into the ground simply to achieve a physical or financial goal, but instead to live a genuinely more fulfilled life. I will get you there by becoming the master of the world around you and then showing you how you can literally grow your brain. So let's go. Now if you can't control your surroundings, you will fail tremendously at trying to control your own mind. One of the secrets of making living more disciplined easy isn't to become more disciplined. You don't need to become a monk that can sit in a room full of candy video games and adult sites and simply resist them. The idea is flawed because we would be wasting our energy trying to resist the bad habits instead of being able to pour our energy into the good habits. So you need to free your environment of temptations and distractions. If you want to be healthier, instead of trying to resist the snacks in your cupboard, simply throw them out. If you want to sleep earlier at night, uninstall all the distractions such as Instagram and TikTok which you spend hours scrolling on before you sleep. You get the concept. You want to shape your environment. But the more powerful way to make discipline easy is by changing your brain. You see there is this part of your brain called the anterior cingulate cortex or short ACC and this part of your brain controls everything related to willpower and therefore discipline. It's connected to the parts of your brain that control things like hormones, emotions, memories, motor control, dopamine, you get it. Everything is controlled by this ACC. So I know that you're smart and you understand that you want this part of your brain to be bigger so that discipline will be easier for you. I have good and bad news for you. The good news is you can grow this part of your brain. The bad news is it will take discomfort and effort before you can reap the benefits of easy discipline. Your ACC grows when you do things that are truly uncomfortable to you. I've talked about this in my other videos, but today I want to give you a unique example that will grow your ACC and improve your life. Imagine you would be able to be truly honest with yourself. You would be able to ask yourself if you should really spend this Wednesday afternoon playing video games or if you should go to the gym because you promised yourself that you're gonna get into shape this year. And then in this dreamy scenario, you would just tell yourself, yeah, I'll go to the gym now. This honesty with yourself is uncomfortable and hard. It's one of those things that really forces you to use your brain to do the right things and to resist instant gratification. Honesty grows your brain, but no one does that, right? No one is truly honest with themselves, and that's because of one thing, a lack of direction. If you really know where you want to go in life, you know what the right steps to take are. But how do you get direction? If you know me in my videos, you know that I really love to emphasize the importance of creating anti-visions. What I mean by that is writing down exactly where you don't want to end up. I'm by no means saying that those are good things, but if you're like most people, your anti-vision is that you don't want to end up lonely, ugly and poor. 
The beauty of anti-visions is that you and me as humans know exactly what we wanted to do if we wanted to fail. So we can write it down. Never be the first to reach out to friends and family. Never ask a girl out on a date. Eat as much junk food as possible. Never work out. Never get a job and never provide value to other people. By now reversing this list of things, we effectively have our game plan and make discipline much easier for us. Whenever we are faced with a question of discipline or no discipline, we now simply have to ask ourselves, will this thing get me closer to my anti-vision or to my true vision? From now on, you know what the true impact of your choices is. Now, not to sound extreme, but if you choose video games over the gym, you know that you're on your best way to becoming ugly, lonely, and poor. What you want to do is to contrast your present moment with your anti-vision and realize what would happen if you don't act disciplined now. I know it sucks to hear, but that is radical honesty. This one habit change because it's difficult, I know it is, will grow your ACC and therefore make you more disciplined and authentic. But wait, all of this is worthless if you don't know how to structure your days to achieve superhuman focus and discipline. Go watch my last video to figure that out.